Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, y'all. Call me like a cherry. Call me like a cherry. Call Your boy done switched up on you. Wait a minute, wait a minute, y'all. You guys, look, if this is your very first time in this channel, run over there and subscribe for me. And after you subscribe, make sure that you hit that notification bell. It's right beside the word subscribe so that you can be notified each and every time that we upload a video. And then, welcome to the Lips family. Now that you're part of the Lips family, that's something that we do. We do it every day because it helps us grow. And we done got to 20K at that. Look, you guys, the thing that I need for you to do is comment, Comment, comment like a share and go for the team. Comment like a share and go for the team. Comment like a share and don't forget to comment like a share. Comment like a share. Comment like a share. Don't forget to comment like a share. Comment like a share. Comment like a share. Don't forget to don't forget to comment like a share. Okay, you guys check this out. We're gonna go ahead and pray, and then we're gonna get into the goodness. Here we go. Amen. How y'all doing today? How you doing? How you doing? How you doing? You guys, look, y'all know we bitch off. We do other things. We do challenges. We do a whole lot of things. We even enjoy some seafood. But we always gonna come back to this, baby. Today, for the food, we have pig ears. We have mixed vegetables. And we've got some cornbread. I also have some tomatoes. Now, you know this meal is one of my favorites because... You know, tomatoes don't work that well with me. Over here to the side, I've got the Lips hot sauce. I have got the pink salt. And Big Ben is in the building, baby. Big Ben is here. Big Ben is here to help me out. Because y'all, we finna get to eat it. Let's see if he's nice and refreshing. Yes, he is. Okay, you guys. Let's get it, let's get it, let's get it. Let's get it. I need some of these tomatoes here. Y'all, pig ears is one of my favorite meals. It's actually my favorite meat. Just like a meat, you know what I'm saying? Just like a like a favorite meat, like some people's favorite meat is chicken. Pig ears is really my favorite meat in the world. It really, really is. And then, the way that I eat it gives me an opportunity to eat tomatoes, because I can't, tomatoes don't work that well with me. Y'all, we got some fat back. You see that? We got some fat back over here in our mixed vegetables, honey. First bite. Y'all, it's good. That's good. Mm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. We're gonna put some lips hot sauce on this here. We're gonna put some lips hot sauce all up in here, honey. Yes, we are. Oh, I didn't get y'all no piece without the hot sauce. But I'm finna give you a piece with it on there. I sure am. Here you go. There you go, there you go, there you go, there you go. You see it? Do you see it, baby, 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 baby? Mm-mm, mm-mm, mm-mm. Y'all, it's good. Y'all got some cornbread. See it? Mm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. The cornbread is actually a little soft. Because I didn't have no milk on So I just added some mayonnaise. <laughs> I didn't have no sour cream either. I just added mayonnaise. Which makes it, you know, a little lighter, but it's still a cornbread. I hope you got you a bite. Y'all, this is him. 
Mm. Mm -mm -mm. I can't get no potato. Mm -mm -mm. Y'all gotta put some hot sauce on there. Here you go. That's a fat back. That's any mixed vegetable. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Mm. Y'all, this is good. It's so good. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Oh, the pig ears was in like the crock pot all day long, just simmering, honey. Mmm. Y'all yeah, good. Okay. I'm taking a chance on these bowls, y'all. Because they're screaming something like these bowls. But anywho, how y'all doing today? I'm looking out cross-eyed. I am. How y'all doing today? Uh, how you doing? Oh, y'all, my sip away over here. Mm -hmm. mm -mm -mm. Y'all, we're going to have to put a little pink side in here now. I don't know why, but in the camera, like when I put the salt on the food, when I look back through the playback, it be like it be a whole lot of salt to be coming out, but it don't be like that to me, y'all. It don't look like that. Mm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. That is good. Mm -hmm. Mm. Oh. So y'all, earlier today, when I was getting ready to record, well, when I was getting ready to start cooking my food to record, somebody, I don't forget who it was, but one of y'all told me in the comments a couple of days ago, it was like, I love to see you eat pig ears and pig uh, feet. Pig tail, they put that in there too. And I told them, coming soon. Coming soon, baby. Mm-hmm. Because y'all know me now. The new legion, you don't know me yet. But I'm going to tell you something. You will always get a good old country meal up out of lips. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. For real, because I was raised eating this way. I was raised eating like this. So I'm going to eat on the show. Because I love these foods. I really do. Like, I love, I don't know, just soul food. I love me some pork. Because I was raised on I told you when I was young, my family, they raised hogs on our land. So I'm used to eating it. I mean, we, in the wintertime, when they were slaughtering them hogs, baby, when I tell you it was a family affair, it was a family affair. Everybody had a job. And then at the end of the day, I'm going to tell you how you knew when the day was getting, you know, to where you've been to wrap it up. Now, when they slaughter these hogs, they slaughter them like early in the morning while it's cold. I think that's to help it like preserve the meat, you know what I'm saying, doing it when it's cold. Or at least, you know, keep it good long enough while, you know, you cutting it up and getting like the hams off of it, the chitlins, the hog mouth. The feet, the tail, the snout, 
the ear. Excuse me, I started. So, when they saw these hollers, you don't waste none of it. The only thing you waste is what's not edible. And baby, <laughs> as you can see from my show, a whole lot of it is edible. Y'all, I'm trying something new. Because everybody keeps telling me look into the camera as opposed to look into the viewfinder. So that's what I'm trying to do. So if I look a little cross-eyed, because it feels a little weird to me, you know what I'm saying? Mmm. 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 So, if I look a little cross-eyed and weird, it's because this is uncomfortable for me. For real. But, If me changing a small thing, you know about the way I record, trying to get better, you know what I'm saying? If that's something I need to work on, is looking into the camera and say the viewfinder, I cannot not try it. You know what I'm saying? I may have a little stupid one video. <laughs> but I hope that it is better for you. I really, really do, because that's what I'm trying to do, even though it's awkward for me. Uh, y'all, I'm dropping stuff all around me. I am. This is good. This is so good. I'm for real. This is so good, y'all. Mm, 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 mm. Y'all, it's good. <laughs> it's good. Mmm. 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 Yeah, this feels good. This cornbread is like, you know, good cornbread is good cornbread. If you know how to cook cornbread, because I have suggested to people before, when I gave them recipes on how to cook what I was eating, if the meal requires cornbread, people don't know how much of a staple of a meal that cornbread is. For real, for real. So I have told people before on the show, like if we doing, you know, greens or cabbage or, you know, something that you need cornbread with, I've told them before, if you can't cook no cornbread, ask your neighbor. Because me, myself, and I, if it's a meal I got to have cornbread, I cannot deal with no nasty, I cannot deal with no nasty cornbread. For real. And believe it or not, as simple as it is, cornbread is something that people mess up often. Trust me. Mm-hmm. Me, myself, and I, I don't want no nasty cornbread. Nope. Mm. Baby, this is good. It's good. Uh, Big Ben is having us right. I'll just down. Mm-hmm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I got another big old piece of fat back in now. But I'm waiting to eat it. Y'all ate the piggies up. I knew they were going to be gone. Right now, a real, on the new side where the pig is off. Honey, you ain't seen them but some red soup. <laughs> I know you did. <clears throat> Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Big Ben. <sighs> trying to be funny. I like to get choked out. For real. For real, for real, for real. Mm-hmm. Oh. Oh, that's good. There's a lot of hot sauce in there, though. For real. A lot of hot sauce. Mm.
All right. Y'all. Honey. This food is good. It's real good. Periphery of lips. For real lips. Uh, Y'all, if these bowls look a mess in this video, I apologize. Uh, I apologize for it. I really, really do. But I went on and took it. Y'all, I got another pig here over here to the side. It's a whole one. Woo! Woo! It's kind of hot a little bit. I got nothing over him. Because I figured, I figured that the two I had in there weren't going to be enough. So I put me a nerd, in. not another one, but a nerd. In. I put a nerd over there. Yes, I did. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. What I was telling y'all while I was going, it just came back to my mind. When they used to swallow these hogs right, as a child and being used to it, You just ready for it to be over with. So I'm going to tell you when you know it's ready to be over with. When the day is about to wrap up now, as a child, all I knew was it was going to be a big black cast iron, like a, um, it's like a bowl, like really, really big. Maybe three, four feet tall, you know, big around. It was cast iron. When they built a fire and they put that cast iron a bowl up there to heat it up, baby, you knew they were finna cook crackers because that was the last thing you were gonna do. Cooking the crackers was gonna be the last thing. But they gonna do everything else. You know, slice and dice and get all the meat, share it with the neighborhood. You know, give away what parts you don't want. But they use that hog. They did. So I grew up eating it. A lot of people say, well, it's so bad for your health and pork this and pork that. But honey, I've been eating it all my life. I guarantee you. I probably had a pig ear before I had McDonald's. <laughs> I'm not lying to you. I am not lying to you. Put, that went right on down there in that hot sauce, y'all. Well, we got it. We got it. Mmm. Mmm. Ugh. Oh, for real, though. Well, I probably had a pig here before I had McDonald's. Ugh. We planted gardens. Like, we used to have big, beautiful gardens. For real. <clears throat> and then it was like, <coughs> hold on, y'all. Hold on. But y'all, this is how it went. Like, in the community, like if our family, you know, raised hogs and killed hogs, another family down the road would, like, uh, have cows. That would be their, you know, like, animal or whatever. Everybody standing pretty much had chickens because that's how you got your eggs. And like, when my grandfather raised cabbage and corn, down the street, they would have like a pea patch. And then down the street on the other side, they would have like a, you know, like a green patch, like turnip green, mustard green, that type of thing. And then, you know what I'm saying? Like, the, the community worked together. They really, really did back then. And they strategized on how everybody was, you know, going to be able to have everything that they wanted and needed and grew it out the land or raised it. So I would raise this way, y'all. I was. And it's all I know. Mm. 
Mm-hmm. Mm. That's all I know, y'all. So, no matter what we do, how many challenges we do, how much seafood we eat, honey, we I cannot deter. From what I know, I cannot. I will not. Y'all be being been working overtime today. But y'all, I got pulled now. And the thing of it is, um, I done got real pulled. For real, y'all. This food was good. It was good. I love me up here. Ear hang. I really, really do. And then I take these, these diced tomatoes. I take them and cook them some more. Excuse me, y'all. And cook them some more. Oh, excuse me. You know, the, to minimize the chance of, you know what I'm saying, it doing something to me. So they be warm and ready. Because they pair so well with pig ears. Pig snout. Mm-hmm. I did pig snout one time on my channel. Mm-hmm. I'm sure I eat again. I thought before them y'all. Hey! <laughs> I thought before. Well I am for, okay. Y'all, I know we didn't talk about nothing today. I just ate, honey, I ate. They were good too. I hope you enjoy. I really do. Big Ben says good night. <laughs> Big Ben says good night. Mm. Y'all, we're finna go. We're finna go. We're finna go. We're finna go. You guys, this was delicious. It really, really was. We got to talk a little bit. That hot sauce got my nose running. We got to talk a little bit. I talked to you a little bit about my childhood. Because that's how I grew up, y'all. For real. And my family raised hogs. And with that being said, with that being said, I'm used to eating it. So, I know a lot of y'all be in the comments and y'all be saying, do some more soul food, do some more soul food. That's what I like. Or I get asked about pig feet, pig tails a lot. But the ear is actually my favorite. So anyway, I hope you guys have enjoyed. I hope you have enjoyed. I really, really do. I enjoyed this meal. I love you all. I love each and every one of you guys. And don't forget if I look stupid. <laughs> I'm trying to make the video look better for you. If these bowls messing up in the video, I'm sorry. I tried it. I tried it, honey. I tried it. Knowing that sometimes they don't work well with them screens. But anyway, you guys, we finna go. We finna go. We finna go. I love you all so, 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 so much. Child, my new legion, thank you so much for being here. You did not have to be here. You could have been anywhere else in the world, but you chose to be here with us, and we love you for it. Welcome to the legion. If you're on the fence and you ain't hit that button yet, go and hit that button for your boy. I'd enjoy for you to join us, to join us. Anyway, you guys, I love you all. I love each and every one of you guys. My existing legion, I ain't got to say it to you, but I do tell you every day, you know I love you. I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you. Thank you guys so, so much for being here, and we better get up out of here, okay? We better get up out of here. You guys, don't forget to go and see my mukbang bulls, Big Mac. You love Sunny. Look at M.O. Eats in Sam's world. Make sure you go see him. Y'all, I had the bird right there. <laughs> y'all, we better go. We better go, okay? Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, y'all. You guys, look. Always remember, when obstacles come up in your life, there's always more than one way home. All you have to do is get there. So get there, people. Get there. I love you all. And I'll see you guys next time. And if you're not here to watch me next time, you have lied to me. And I know you lied. Period. <laughs> bye. Bye. Mwah.
Legion, that felt so weird. It really, really does. And like I said, I'm trying because they say that it's better for you. Like, it's better for you, you, however it go. I'm trying to learn how to do it. But they say it's better for you if I look into the camera straight at you. I guess that's what it's going to look like to look straight at you. That's what I'm doing right now. But then for me to look at the viewfinder and look at myself. So I'm going to try it. I'm going to try it. I hope you guys have enjoyed. I really, really do. I love you guys so, so, so much. I really, really do. I love you. So, you guys, I'm going to tell you something. I'm going to tell you something that's very, very important because I want you to know. I really want you to know. I love you guys so, so, so much. Me and my family, we appreciate each and every one of you guys hitting that button. Hitting that bell first. Hitting that bell, y'all. And then coming to watch every day. I appreciate that. I really, really do. You guys are the best in the business. I've always said it. And I keep saying it. I cannot stop telling you that you're the best in the business. I love you guys so, so much. We've been good up out here, okay? I love you. I'm going to see you tomorrow with another video. Yes, we're going to have another video in tomorrow. I kind of think I know what we're going to eat. It's going to be good. It really, really is. <laughs> anyway, you guys, I love you. Bye-bye.